Hey guys, I'm Satorio Phil. Welcome back to my channel. Today's video is a more detailed video on two items I picked up from my recent Paris haul back in October. And these are two Louis Vuitton items from the Runway Collection, the Ready to Wear Fall Winter 2018, which was Kim Jones's last collection for Louis Vuitton. And I'm going to go through both of these and then I'm also going to have a try on portion so you can kind of see how they look like on. And I'm going to start with the basketball shirt. So this basketball shirt has like a metallic color finish and it comes in two colors. This one's the, I think, Leyton Historique and it comes in a more gray color. This is an oversized fit so you'll see later on when it's on me. It's meant to be very drapey. This was the smallest size they had left though. They do make this in an extra small but the size that I got was a small. And this one retails for $1580 in the US and $1100 Euro in Paris, which is where I got this shirt. It's a mess, mesh shirt on the bottom. You can see there's kind of perforations. However, this fabric is really heavy. It's not what you would think of an actual basketball shirt that you would wear to play basketball. It's quite thick. So you can't really actually see through it. I think you'll have to shine light through it in order to see what's behind it. So if you're worried about this being see-through, I really don't think that would be much of an issue. I actually think this looks better with something below it too. And the way this is constructed, the way the shoulder, the sol the shoulder streams are constructed is that it's straight through to the top which means when you wear it, your shoulder actually starts more right here, not on the shoulder stream, which adds to the oversized and drapey silhouette of this. What's really cool about this is the lettering. So Louis is in Python leather, and even though it's outlined in black, it's actually one solid piece for each letter. And then they use some sort of matte paint or screen printing to outline it. And this python is also in kind of a metallic bronze or champagne kind of color. So due to this fabric, you can see in this video, it has a, it has a really cool metallic sheen to it. And then it has a ribbed v-neck on top. I think this was a pretty standout piece from the show. And it was available, so I figured I would pick it up. And I really like the leather. The python leather makes it much more unique. It does, if you have python leather, you'll know that it kind of can get a little scratchy depending on which side of the grain you brush up against. And sometimes, especially with this kind of fabric, you can hear the fabric pulling a little bit. So this is definitely a much del a pretty delicate shirt. So you will have to be careful. There may be some stock left in local stores, but in the US, it's completely sold out online you'll have to see if your store may have one or two left or if they can transfer one in. It's gonna depend. It's pretty expensive though for basically a short sleeve shirt. The next item is the zip through reversible bousson. It's, it's a jacket. It has a black matte zipper, which I think they don't tend to use this, but for this collection, it matched the colors. And because it's reversible, the zipper, the zipper pull can actually go all the way inside. And besides the terrain print, the, the other detail is that in the back there is a leather patch, which has Vuitton, it has the Champs-Élysées address on the bottom. This piece, I just really love how the texture, the depth of the texture and the details play with the kind of shape of this. And this is more of an athletic fit, so I got it in a small, which, I mean, it was the smallest size available anyway, but actually fits me pretty well. I think an extra small would have been a bit too tight on me. And, be, and the reversible side, I do wish there was something a little bit more interesting. The reverse side is just gray. And I think the fabrics are different. The front is more of a viscose blend and then the interior is a wool blend. And you'll find the tag because it's reversible, it's in the inside pocket of the gray side. This is a small, and it's also made in Italy. Gentle, dry, clean. So the material says it's made out of wool and polyamide and elastane. And then there's calfskin, which is the black patch. 
there's some stitching details on the pockets too. And what's cool about this is that both sides have these hidden slot or slit pockets. And then there's black stitching on it, which is a little bit more pronounced. So the, the stitching is more pronounced on the reverse side. It's still kind of tone on tone because it's black stitching on a dark gray fabric. And the stitching is due to the busyness of the te texture. You don't really see the stitching as much on the main side. And on the website, they don't show you what the reverse side is. So if you had just purchased it online, it could have been a blind purchase in terms of what it would look like on the reverse. And this one kind of matches the silk bandana that I got from the collection. So if you watch my earlier video where I had gotten the track, kind of the, the rash guard and the tights, they featured the terrain print as well and the monogram and the reflective material. But unfortunately I had to return that because it just, the reflective material just wouldn't work for me wearing it because it was just way too delicate. The print here is in a different scale and the contrast is a little bit different, but it definitely looks, I think it looks cool worn together, like as a, as a silk scarf or kind of like a, when you wear it as a triangle scarf is really cool because it's similar and yet it's contrasting. And then you, you have a peak of the LV monogram as well. So now I'm gonna try on both of these for you.
And that's my video. Thank you for watching. Subscribe for more videos and check me out on Instagram for the latest updates and exclusive content. And I hope to see you in my next video.